Hi there. This video will not be a review of this camera. It will not include a video test. It will just include something that I think this camera does extremely well and lots of people don't actually even know uh, they need this uh, thing from a camera, but they do. So let me explain what that actually is. So this will be a talking uh, head behind the camera, hands in front of camera video. I will be unboxing this uh, Insta360 Go2 action camera, which is extremely small compared to other action cameras. Yes, by default, it might not be as tough as some of them, and I cannot cut into this with my fingernails. Be back in a second. Let's continue the unboxing. But because it is so small and so light, it's ideal for one thing. And let me try and explain what I realized that lots of people are doing and many don't even uh, know that it's happening. Just think about an air show, for example, or at the beach. Many times you see people experiencing things by actually looking at the phone screen while they are taking a video. So they are not directly seeing what's happening in front of them. They are seeing something that a camera sees and then puts the image on your phone screen and then you see it. That's really dumb. You are actually missing on the real experience from this. But then again, there are people that are not recording at all. So they are having the full life experience, but they don't have as many clear me memories of uh, that uh, experience because yes, over time your memories will fade. I don't really care who you are and how good your memory is. You will start to lose uh, details. So I found my, myself uh, many times just recording things but not living in the moment. When I tried to live in the moment, I didn't have enough recordings a few years later when I tried to remember that particular event. And having two small daughters that are growing up, <clears throat> you want to have the moment and the memories on video. So this is where this little camera comes in. And for, I don't know, in, at a concert, for example, don't you hate it when you see almost all the people with their phones up uh, above their head recording. It's even annoying to watch. It's annoying to, to, to record like that. Again, look at this little thing. It's, it's minuscule. And look at it how it's from the start, how it stays here. It's magnetic. So this little camera has a few accessories with it. We will see them in a moment. Again, this is not a real unboxing. It's not a, a, a review. It's, it's just me showing a product that some of you might not even know they need. This thing, for example, the pendant, you put it either on top of your shirt or behind your shirt. And what your chest is pointing at this camera will record and this has a wide enough field of view that it, it will capture everything and has so good stability, video stability. It's, whew, it's, it's really good. This little guy, the Go2, it's awesome in terms of uh, video quality. And it obviously can connect to your uh, mobile phone. It doesn't have a screen. Where can it have a screen being this small? It can also, a really important thing, at least for me, connect to a hat. So you, you have your hat on your head. You put this thing right in here. I think I put it the wrong way around. Yes, I did. And you connect it to, 
to your hi, uh, head somehow. Let me think how it actually works. Yeah, I wasn't recording. So to the, is it the brim, the flat part of your head? So you connect it to that and point it directly forward. And whatever you are pointing your head at, this thing records or you can put it upwards so it, you don't even have it in your field of view with your eyes. It's, I don't know. So you are experiencing an event. You are with uh, your child uh, at the beach. This is recording for you and you are doing hands-free recording. You can play with the, the kids with both hands and you are still seeing uh, everything recorded on video. It, I don't know why more people don't, don't realize that this is a thing and just having your phone pointed at something, it's not good enough. And we also have this little case with these little kickstands that it creates a small tripod. Again, this is not a review. Don't expect this to be a review. And almost all attachments of this are uh, magnetic. You can see the little pogo in there. This also has it included battery, so it will charge the camera when it's in here. You can use it like this to film something. You can put it down. <clears throat> Not really a good tripod. It's kind of small, especially in this direction, but it's better than nothing. And obviously you can adjust it to where you want it to be pointing. Ah, what else do we have in, in this little... And yes, it's also carrying case. And as you can see, it has a tripod mount in there. And a USB Type-C uh, charging. And the charge case, it's not waterproof. But the camera itself is waterproof. So this little thing, you can hold it in your hand or do whatever you want with it, even in water. Zero issues, it will not care. Yeah, there's that. What else do we have here? We have this, another uh, kind of uh, attachment. I'm not even honestly sure exactly how this one works. Yeah, I, I think I know. This is a weird... Uh, is this the... The one with the weird sticky material, yes it is. So this is sticky by default, the material on this. It will stay on many surfaces for a long time by default. So you can stick this even in your the windshield of your car and find a way to, to rotate this to record what you are uh, actually experiencing with your car. So it can even be used as somewhat of a, of a dash camera. Like that, for example. You stick it in the windshield and it will record. So, but for me, the most important thing is the hands-free autonomous recording. I basically don't want to be bothered with knowing that I'm holding a camera and oh, I just missed a moment because I, I didn't record. No, I go for a walk by the seaside or something Put this on my head or on my chest. I, this thing is awesome. And just do my normal routine, what I intend to do at that moment. And don't think about, yeah, I just missed a moment or ah, let me record this. No, this is recording. And at the end of the day, I cut what I need to from what it recorded. Keep what is important, delete the rest. And I didn't miss anything. So yeah, I know this is a weird video, but the second I, I realized the potential of this camera and compared to something like a GoPro, which is about twice the size, presumably, and uh, way heavier, this works much better in other environments where, no, honestly, would you stay like this with a GoPro st uh, stuck to your chest? No, you wouldn't. Would you stay with one stick to your uh, baseball hat or your beanie? No, you wouldn't. But with this little thingy, look at this. This is smaller than my thumb, honestly. 
you can use this awesomely so yeah i know this is a weird video of just me rambling but i just hate to see people not living the moment and still not getting uh, quality recordings just because they they missed something with this you will not miss anything so hope this video op opens up uh, some people's eyes honestly i got this from a second hand website in my country it's uh, new as you could see it but it's not new from a store and it was less uh, less than 200 euros for an extremely well built uh, and good quality camera for me that's a win-win and i might even use it for uh, youtube at points in time we will see about that because again it connects to an app on the phone and i have full control over the settings and whatnot but the settings can also be adjusted uh, via this little uh, screen right here when the camera is connected to this uh, charging uh, case yeah that's about it if you have any questions feel free to ask in the comments and as always see you in the next one